everybody, welcome back to my channel. Um, so it's time to do my 28 week bump day. Basically I'm going to be talking about weeks 26, 27 and I will talk about a few days from week 28 seeing as I am 28 weeks and 3 days now. Um, it's been good weeks, I mean I have been getting more uncomfortable. Um, a baby boy moves so much like he does not stop kicking me and moving around and my whole belly goes like jelly when he's doing it it's it's like really weird but it's so amazing like there's a human in my stomach basically um i have been suffering really really bad heartburn um like really bad heartburn i've tried the bananas i've tried milk which does help most of the time. I do have a big glass of cold milk before bed every um, night, or most nights. Um, I've got some similar to Rennie's I suppose they are, they're called Almax, but they don't help very much and they're not very nice. One of the girls from Instagram is sending me a package with some Tums in it, which I'm excited for them to arrive. Hopefully they will arrive today, otherwise they won't arrive till Monday now as it we don't have postal service till um, on the weekends, which is poop, but anyway, hopefully they'll arrive. Um, I've had really bad back pain, but that's been going on for a while and it just seems to be getting worse. My mum bought me a back brace, which I've been using like a back support thing, belly support, back support thing. And um, I do use it if I know I'm going to be walking around a lot and standing up a lot, um, which is when it's worse, when my back is worse. Um, walking upstairs can be tiring. Um, apart from that, I haven't really had anything else. It's heartburn and backache is the thing that's driving me nuts. Again, uh, for the last, don't know how many weeks I've been saying it, I don't sleep a lot during the night. I wake up to go to the toilet, I wake up because I'm thirsty, I wake up because of heartburn, I wake up because I'm uncomfortable. So I normally sleep probably from 11.30 till 2 and then I'm awake from 2 till 4.30 and then I'll sleep from 4.30 till 8 when I just wake up. Um, I think it's because Miguel's alarm goes off so it just, I wake up as well. But that's fine. I get more things done during the day. We haven't done any baby purchases in the last two weeks so I have nothing to show you. We did buy some knobs like for his... Um, dresser but you'll see those in the nursery reveal um, or if you follow me on Instagram you will have seen them because I posted a picture on there. As I said I'm 28 weeks and 3 days. Yesterday I had my 28 week scan which normally you don't have but because baby has SUA um, we have extra growth, growth scans like in-depth growth scans like in between our normal scans if that makes sense. So. We went yesterday, my mum came with me because Miguel was working and uh, we, she saw baby boy, um, I made sure to ask her is he still a boy because this is what's going on, you told me boy, the other woman told me girl, then I was told a boy and he is, he is still a he which whew, I am happy about because his nursery is nearly done. <laughs> um, we, we also, she checked his kidneys because the SUA could affect the kidneys but his kidneys are doing good he weighs roughly one kilo 300 so that is good because all the books and apps say he should weigh between one and one one hundred and fifty fifty so he's getting big he's head down so he's in the position he's head down and his legs are up by my ribs which i know because he kicks me like absolutely crazily um, his heart looked good and everything just looked perfect, they were really happy. I asked for my gestational diabetes uh, results and I just passed. Um, I think if you're over 139 you failed and I was 134. But I am so happy that I passed. Like my friend was telling me the diet that she's been put on and I don't think I can do it. I'm such a fussy eater and I love my like my crisps and my cereal in the morning, things like that. I don't know what I'd do. 
but anyways I passed yes I passed I'm so happy I passed I have another scan now at 32 weeks which is in four weeks um, time at the end of May and then I have another that will be my last routine scan and then I have another scan at 36 weeks which will be from his, by because of his SUA and I think from there I will have 36, 37, 38, 39 or until I deliver because he could be born early if he stops growing so yeah that's everything I have to update you on I think not much more so I thought I'd show you my 28 week and 3 day bump so here we go this is my bump from the side and this is my bump from the front it's still a ninny um, I hope you all have a fantastic weekend um, and I'll be back in two weeks time to do 30 week bump date. Thank you.